So I snagged one of these the other day on eBay for a pretty good deal. Uh, under a hundred bucks, high 90s range. I thought that was a pretty good deal. And uh, it's been about a year since these came out. I just realized because uh, my first video of me opening them was uh, November 1st, so today's October 31st, Halloween, and I'm going to open one of these up because these were pretty fun to open, and we'll see after a year, I guess, how well they've aged. So there's the... Play mat and looks like our promos might be hiding. Oh, they're at the bottom. Usually find those at the top. Get the code out of the way. Our condition marker ended up loose, which is common. We get the sleeves, all that other loose stuff. And pretty sweet pack selection. Um, as far as getting hits out of those packs, it's been tough for me. Um, actually, the condition on this promo looks fairly good. Like, I've seen some weird edge wear before on these. This actually looks pretty decent. But I might leave that sealed. And we get three Fusion Strike. There's our uh, Charizard coin. We get three Evolving Skies, a Vivid, and a Darkness. And we get some uh, two Lost Origin, and three Astral, and three Brilliant. So I'll probably just kind of pick at these randomly, depending on how I feel. I don't see the crimp error on any of those. I sometimes had a weird crimp error that came along with Pax and Charizard UPCs. Starting off with a hit, Galarian Obstagoon. So a trainer gallery hit right off the bat. And Reg Ice. And let's go Vivid and Darkness. Maybe Darkness will get the uh, Charizard Remax. Blitzel, Slugma, Beldum, Milsery, Wooper, Yanma Reverse, and the Flareon. Alright, Darkness Blaze. Ah, that looks weird. Uh, but it's on the top and the bottom. The packs in these Charizard UPCs really look weird sometimes. Oh, we got a green code. Whoa! Looks like we got a Scent of Scorch hit. Out of a green code. Got a Scent of Scorch. I love this card. I love the colors on this card. Very nice. We got a weird uh, kind of damage right there. And some kind of uh, silvering up there. But that's not bad. Back looks decent. That's cool. I love seeing this card. There's some cards that just have really nice colors. That's, that's one of them. Give that a uh, top loader. And yeah, let's go with some fusion. Pancham, Galarian Darumaka, Indeedy, ugh, Growlithe, got Shelter Reverse, and Chandelure V Max. Okay. Not too shabby.
Nothing crazy, but it's a VMAX hit. Not too bad. Always love seeing that cracking off. Great. All right, let's switch over to some Lost Origin because you know we're not going to get any hits out of Lost Origin. Or at least no strong hits. Pseudo Wudo, because the alt arts in Lost Origin are just insanely hard to pull. Porygon Reverse and Porygon Z. Let's get into some Brilliant. Duskull. Farfetch'd, did I? Yeah, over the long term, the prices on these should creep up, but the crazy supply we had at the start just uh, made these really affordable. Good for pack opening. Oh, I think, I mean, I've opened a bunch of these. I think maybe in one of them I had um, at one point pulled a Charizard V alt art from Brilliant Stars, but that was not the norm. A lot of these you'd get two or three hits maybe. It was really below average. But the pack selection is really hard to beat, especially if you really like the Sword and Shield era. And which I do. And back to Astral. Psyduck, Petalo, Stantler, Bergmite, Hippopotas, got a Radiant Halucha. It's a little, little mini hit. The Braviary. Let's go. No, let's go Fusion. Mankey, Clauncher. Growlithe, Stuffle, Sigilyph, Galarian Zigzagoon, and Zora. Okay. Actually, let's finish up the fusion. Never pulled the Espeon VMAX alt art from fusion. But I wouldn't expect it out of a Charizard UPC. Clef Key. And Absol. Yeah. All right. Let's go brilliant then. With the white code showing. Magmar, Cub Chew, Dedenne, No Space, No Runt, Tropius Reverse. And evolving. I like the Duraludon pack art. Let's see if that's the last. I don't know why. I think at one point I pulled something good out of a Duraludon pack art. No, I just always save that pack art for last. Emulga, Wubat, Bergamite, and Gigalith. Yeah, we're not going to get any hits out of it. Uh, evolving. Let's just get it out of the way. Hopefully we can pull something out of... Uh, oh, we got a Gyarados VMAX. I mean, that's something, I think. It's like a $3 card. Give that a sleeve. And Gyarados is just a cool Pokemon. So, we got three left. Let's go Astral. Get the Beedrill V Altar. It's all I've ever wanted from Astral, and the Astral's just never given it to me. It's not, not nice. Ponita, always nice to see that one. Chat Tot, Scyther, and Suing Avalog. Ooh. We'll try to give uh, Lost Origin last path magic. Black code, black border code, 
Gullet, Gorefish, Sock, although we're due for a hollow. I don't think we've pulled a hollow. Burn me. Asian <laughs> Professor's Research called it, unfortunately. I would have rather have been wrong. And Lost Origin. <laughs> oh, I don't think Lost Origin is that nice. Uh, ah, nope. So not too much out of there. Don't know what I'm opening next, but uh, I guess that was okay. Got a full art. I got a couple V Maxes, so I'll take it anyway, and I'll take a closer look at this after this video because it looks pretty nice. But uh, anyway, good luck on your own openings. See you on the next one.